Good afternoon, and welcome to another segment of the Worth Report for December 12th. Keep America vigilant. To 22. Twitter files. The removal of Donald Trump. Over the weekend and into today, Elon Musk, through independent journalists, continues to reveal secret internal discussions at Twitter to expose their corruption, this time surrounding the historical removal of a sitting president, President Trump, from its platform. The latest drops also clearly prove that the FBI, DHS, and DNI were colluding with Twitter on a regular basis to silence, suppress, and ban Americans surrounding the 2020 election. This segment will show you the smoking guns in the most direct violation of the First Amendment we've seen in our time. Part 1 of this new series was released on Friday and covers October of 2020 through January 6th. One executive said that in deciding whether to remove President Trump over a potential last straw tweet, two factors needed to be taken into account. The, quote, overall context and narrative in which that tweet lives, and the, quote, narrative that Trump and his friends have pursued over the course of this election and, frankly, last four-plus years. They ultimately went with the latter. Yoel Roth, whom we previously reported on, became more and more brazen in his internal workings against a sitting president and Americans who questioned the 2020 election. One might call this treason. In one discussion thread, Roth stated that his calendar meetings have become, quote, very interesting to people and that, quote, there weren't meeting names generic enough to cover. In the same thread, a redacted employee states, quote, very boring business meeting that is definitely not about Trump. Roth replied, stating, quote, pretty much, and, quote, definitely not meeting with the FBI, I swear. But wait, it gets even better. Quote, on October 8, 2020, executives opened a channel called US 2020 underscore XFN underscore enforcement. Through January 6th, this would be home for discussions about election-related removals, especially ones that involved high-profile accounts. This became a, quote, high-speed Supreme Court of moderation. From this point on, we're not allowed to say or show you what we're about to on this platform, or we'll almost certainly be punished for it. Please, join us for the rest of this segment at theworthreport.com for only $1.99 a month or $15 for an annual subscription. Your support helps us to keep doing what we're doing. See you there.